just before this video begins, um, I just want to say don't forget to follow my Twitch and don't forget to follow all my social medias. And I always stream at 7 p.m. CST, Monday through Fridays. Hopefully, I just started college, so hopefully this won't be outdated. But yeah, all right, okay, enjoy the video. Bye bye. Sweetheart, you in there? <sighs> Make a noise. Tell me where you are. Oh, thank God. The door is stuck. Okay, give me a second. <clears throat> hey, hey, I'm here. I'm here. Look at me. Sweetheart, look at me. There's so much blood. Oh my god. Hey, there you are. Easy, easy. I'm here. I told you I was coming, right? I'm sorry I'm late. Look at me. Focus on me. What happened? What did they do to you? Wolfsbane? Shit, where? Injected you with it? Oh, whoa, whoa. hey, stay awake. Stay with me, alright? We gotta get the Wolfsbane out of your system. Hold on. I need to call for some help. Okay? Lydia. Yeah, I've got them. But they're in rough shape. Wolfsbane IV. It's bad, Lydia. How do I get it out of their system? Uh, I don't know. I don't see anything. Wait, yeah, the IV pole is here. No, they're gone. I've cleared this whole place out. I've cleared the last stragglers. Celine. Uh, yeah, there's a bag here. I've never won them before, but... Okay, let me put you on speaker. Lid, you hear me? Yeah, I hear you too. I got it. How do I find a vein? Sweetheart, wake up. Wake up now. There you are. Hi. Listen, Lydia is on the line. She's gonna help me patch you up, alright? No, 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 no. Don't move. I need to get some of these fluids in you, alright? I gotta flush out the whooping out. I know you hate needles, okay? But baby, I've got to do something about it, alright? I'm not letting you die on me, okay? Not happening. Yeah. It's in, Lid. How do I make sure the fluid is running? Right. Okay. Sweetheart? Hey. There you are. I know. You're tired, but you gotta hang on for a little bit longer. No nap time right now, okay? I know, I know. You can be upset with me later, alright? How long would this take, Lydia? Alright. Okay. Look at me. There you are. Of course I came for you. You think some werewolf hunters could stop me? They just delayed me a little bit. No, no, no. None of that nonsense. You are not a monster. You're not. You're a werewolf. Yeah, but that doesn't make you inherently evil. No, it doesn't. Because my partner, the one who surprises me with breakfast in bed, the one who buys me flowers just because, isn't a monster. No. You're not. The hunters don't know you. They think they do. But they don't. They are so fucking wrong. I love you too. So much. 
No. None of this feral crap. You're gonna be fine. Hey. I mean it. You are going to be fine. We'll get you fixed up, get you out of here, and then get you home. Yeah, of course. Whatever you want. Just stay with me. Lydia, they're fading. What do I do? I got it. I'm running it as fast as I can. Right. Okay. Let me check. No, I'm not here. Come on, where is it? Got it. It's red, right? All right. Sweetheart, you need to drink this. I know. You can sleep later, but right now, you need to drink this. It will make you feel better. Don't go limping on me, okay? No. No, hey. Eyes open. Shit! Sweetheart? Lydia! They're not moving! What do I do? They're not- don't, don't do this to me, don't do this to me, please don't do this to me, no, no, please come back! They're not breathing, Lydia, I need help! Five minutes is five too many! Come back to me, please! One, two, three, four, five. There's a pulse. Thank God. Lydia, give me something. I've never casted that before. I don't know. Okay, okay. Just tell me what to do. It worked, but... They're still not waking up. How far are they? Fuck. Come on, come back to me. Don't leave me like this. I hear them. Lid, can I trust them? Good. It's Wolfsbane poison. They flatlined once I, I did CPR. It's okay. I'm right here. I'm right here with you. They said they flushed it from their system, but <sighs> I know, but if I hadn't been so stupid, I let them there when I knew there were hunters in town. I left them and now, fuck Lydia, if they die, I'll never forgive myself. Just find them, Lydia. Find them. So I can end them myself. You must be loving this, huh? You always said you never got enough sleep. Now here you are. Napping. At least. I would rather call it napping. There are words for it. Well, you know. You know me. Ever the optimist. I have to be. Because if I lose you, I'm not going to make it. I'm not just saying that. I feel it. Deep within my soul. The bond we have. The connection. This connection we have. It's always been comforting to me. I remember when we first started dating. And you'd be a few hours away. I used to miss you so much, but I could feel your presence 
warm, comforting, safe. But it's cold right now. I can't feel you. And that scares the shit out of me. The last time I felt like this was before I met you. I was drifting. Angry. Looking for revenge. Never planning to fall in love with someone. Let alone a werewolf. And then I saw you. Kneeling in mud by the lake. Helping get a little duckling out of a plastic. It was quacking at you and you were just talking back. All of a sudden, my life just clicked. The picture shifted into focus. Everything was clear. Brighter. Better. Because of you. I knew what you were. I'm the kid of hunters. I figured it out. But I just didn't care. So what if you became a werewolf once a month? You didn't hurt anyone. You chained yourself up. You planted wolfsbane to keep you from leaving the house. Even though it gives you headaches. That's not what a monster does. Because you're not a monster. My whole life, I was trained to kill. Protect the innocent. But you, you are innocent. And I, I was supposed to protect you. I failed. When you needed me, I wasn't there. I should have been. I'm sorry. When you get out of here, we're going to go on a trip. Just you and me. To the beach. We can go swimming. I know how much you like the fresh sea breeze. It will be nice. Or maybe we can go over to a carnival or something. Look at the stars on the Ferris wheel. I don't really care what we do. Long as you're there with me. Sappy. I know. I'm gonna find the bastards that did this to you. Gonna make them suffer more pain than they ever put you through. I know you don't like revenge. But. If I don't handle them. They'll just keep coming after you. I can't let that happen. I won't. So you take your time. You rest. As much as you need to. Just come back to me, okay? Show me that bright smile of yours. Because I'm lost without it, sweetheart. I'm not going anywhere. I'll wait. When you're ready. Come back. I'll be here. Lid. Didn't think you'd swing by. No. No change. 
They're still out. The docks. I don't suppose you can call in someone else. Get someone more magically inclined to take a look. I know. And I'm not saying that I'm ungrateful. I just... I need them to wake up soon. And these docks, they're never really treated a werewolf before. I know they can be trusted, but they're nothing like the others. Thanks. I appreciate it. But you didn't have to come to hear me complain. What's up, Lydia? A lead. Tell me what you know. I'm calm. I'm okay. Tell me. For real? Damn. No, it doesn't change a thing. You know where they're gonna be? <sighs> it's either them or them, okay? Lydia, I'm not gonna let them have a second chance at them. Give me the details. I'll go once you've got it all together. Thanks, Lydia. Sweetheart. Lydia's got a lead on the bastards who did this to you. I don't want to leave you, but... I can't give them time to regroup. I can't. I know. Don't rush into things, right? Never been good at being patient. I mean, you've only been out a week and I'm a mess. I can't eat. Can't really sleep. The nurses here stopped trying to get me out of this room when visiting hours ended. Probably think I'm crazy. I don't know. But don't worry. I'm not going to leave you all alone. Lydia will be here. She's a damn powerful witch. You'll be safe in her hands. I don't like having to step into the hunter role. I keep trying to get away from that life. But I guess it's good that I have that training. To keep you safe. I'll be careful though. I know you get mad when I'm not. I don't suppose you want to wake up and lecture me first? <laughs> okay. Worth a shot. Take your time. I'll be right here. I've got it. Lid, not my first time. Just keep an eye on them. If anything happens. Okay. Thanks. I owe you one. All right. Time to go hunting. Hey, fellas. Nice night we're having, isn't it? Just try it. You'll be dead before you can even grab it. Yeah, afraid you didn't have enough security outside. Nah, I usually don't. Was raised to be more professional than I am now. In and out, but you know. You have the distinct honor of pissing me off. Think. Try real hard. That bitch, as you put it, is my partner. 
and I'd watch your tone. <laughs> monster. I'm looking at the monster. You were going to kill an innocent person for what? Because they're a werewolf? No. Let me tell you something. I get it. I was raised in this life. I know what you believe. But you never spent a single day with my partner. You don't know them. You've never seen them sing while cooking pasta. Or how excited they get when they see a cat. Because if you spent that time with them, you'd know. And you'd be angry as much as I am right now. No. Not revenge. They wouldn't want that. This is a message to all the other bastards like you. They're off limits. Lid. It's done. No. I want them to find it. Hunters that read the headlines, they'll know, and they'll back off. Are they okay? Good. I'll be there soon. Just got a few things I need to do first. Thanks, Lid. I've got it. Nah, I'm fine. It didn't touch me. Any changes? What did the doctor say? Good. So just... Beauty rest then. <laughs> yeah. Nah. Don't worry about it. Alright. Fine. A bird would be great. Thanks. Hey. Sweetheart. I'm back. In one piece. I know. You wouldn't approve. I guess it's a good thing you're asleep then. I had to do it. And I don't regret it at all. Those bastards had it coming. They weren't remorseful. Not at all, but hey. That's hunters for you, right? <sighs> you know, I wonder what kind of person I'd be if I hadn't met you. Maybe I'd be no better than them. Hunting because that's what I was taught. Killing innocents in the name of what's right. But that's not my life. Not our life. And hopefully, this will put a stop to any others who have got the same idea. So, we can just be happy. Watch those cheesy movies you love on Netflix, even though they drive me crazy. I love you, love. But I miss you. So much. Sweetheart? What's wrong? Are they okay? Hey, sweetheart. Can you hear me? Yeah. Thank you. Good morning, beautiful. I'm fine. How are you? Yeah, well, you've been out for a while, but it's okay. You're awake now. That's all I need. I'm fine. Promise. Just glad you're awake. So fucking glad. I missed you. So much. You're safe. I promise. You're gonna be fine. 
I know, but you'll need to stay here a little bit longer. Just to make sure you're all good. <laughs> sure. Whatever you want. <laughs> what flavor? Okay. I'll make sure I'll sneak some in then. <laughs> now, take it easy, okay? I'm sure the doctor's kind of come in soon. Check you over. And after that, I will. What? I know. I haven't been sleeping that much. Oh, you'd need the bed. I don't want to jostle anything. And you're doing it anyway. Okay, stop. I'll hold you. I'm not hurting you, right? Good. I don't want to sleep, I just... <sighs> okay, but... <sighs> Wake me up in a few, alright? Lid. Come in. Just a few days ago. They were still pretty out of it. <laughs> but they wanted to garden and was pretty insistent at about it, so I had to let them go. <laughs> yeah, if I had it my way, I would have forced them to rest a little bit longer. But apparently I was being too overprotective. Yeah, stubborn as all hell. But you didn't come down here for that. Something wrong? <laughs> well, of course. I didn't expect them to celebrate it. Hunters were killed, but it had to be done. I don't regret it. Yeah, well, let them complain. Had to make it clear that they were off limits. My family can go take a long walk off a short pier to put it nicely. Yeah, I've heard. How do you think I'm under a spell that I betraying my own species I don't care look out the windows Lydia you see them out there ask me what they're planting ask me Wolfsbane more of it because after nearly dying from it it makes sense that they would plant more right because they only care more about humans than, than most humans do. I know. But I guess the headaches are a small price to pay to make sure no one gets hurt during the full moon. They don't like me staying during it. But... But I was there last month. Before the change. So they chained themselves up. Even ate a bit of wolfsbane to weaken their body. Tell me, Lydia. Does that sound like a monster to you? Anyone else tries? I'll stop them before they even get a glimpse. No, they don't need to know that. I just want them to smile again. If I need to make a river of blood for that to happen, I will. Maybe. 
but I was trained by the best. More than welcome to try. Oh, Han. They would be happy to see you. Want to stay for dinner? <laughs> right. A witch's work is never done. Alright. Have a safe trip back. Damn hunters. Uh, you should really come inside now. You've already been out here for an hour. It's been pretty hot. And you're still recovering. Well, next time, don't nearly die, and you won't have to deal with my overprotectiveness. But as it stands right now, don't ignore me. Do I need to drag you inside? Babe. Sweetheart. You with the gardening tools. Hi. Yes. Please come inside. At least get some water. It's getting hot out here. Thank you. You want ice? Here. I'm not asking. I know. But you could tell me anyways. I'm sorry. I... I... I'll do my best j to just chill. It's just... How do you know that? Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to wake you up. They're just nightmares. They'll pass. And what was that for? No. Not at all. You're just... Usually shy. <laughs> I know that. Alright. My eyes are closed. What are you planning on doing? <laughs> I wouldn't mind that. Alright, I'm done joking. Eyes are closed. I feel your heartbeat. Yeah. I know, but I I almost didn't get there in time. <sighs> okay. All right. You've made your point. You're alive. You're with me. Can I open my eyes? Okay. Come here. I was really scared. I know you did, but for a minute there I thought you were gone. You sure you want to know that? I took them out. The monsters that did this to you. 
And if more come, I'll handle them. I know, but if it's between you and them, I pick you. You know that. I made my choice long ago. If you're the monster, then so am I. Sorry, not sorry. It'll be okay. The, the nightmares will, will pass. And you're getting stronger every day, so that'll help. What kind of question is that? No. You heard me. No. I don't have any regrets about any of this. None. Do you? Good. Protecting you isn't a problem. I'm glad I have these skills. Glad that I can help. I grew up thinking that you were a monster. I was wrong. I was a monster. No, let me finish. I'm being serious. Before I met you, I was cold and cruel. I killed... A lot of monsters that didn't hurt anyone simply because I was told to. If I had been sent after you, I would have killed you without a second thought. But then I met you. And saw how you love to pet stray cats. How you like to make pasta and sing to it while it cooks because you think it can make it tastier. You're no monster. Sometimes, I think you're more of a Marty. I've seen how much the plants outside hurt you. The headaches you try to hide. And you're planting more. Why? Exactly. To protect people. And if hunters understood that, they'd have realized who the true monster was. So yeah. If more hunters come after you. I'll stop them. Even if it's my own family. Because they are the monsters. Not you. Never you. No regrets. Love. Ever. Good. Any chance I could convince you to come inside and rest for a bit? <sighs> fine. I said fine. As long as you're resting, I'll watch whatever dumb show you want. Don't tempt me. Come on, I'll turn on the TV. You want anything to eat? You sure? Come here. Lay on my chest. There we go. I've got you. Alright, let's watch this dumb show. It is. I'm sorry, but your taste in TV is horrible. <laughs> okay, fine, fine. I'll shut up. 
Hey. I love you. Nah. I just felt like telling you. Again. Now. Let's watch. And thank you to my channel members, Riverwood, Alila DE, Sin, Astrid Lemzer, Brianna Hose, DJ Anderson, Michaela Montany, and Elizabeth. I really hope I pronounced all those names properly, and if I didn't, please don't come at me with a pitchfork. <laughs> and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye-bye, everyone.